It's six o'clock, I'm Rob Butler. At least six people have been killed in a train crash at Southall in West London. A high-speed train from Swansea to London crashed into a freight train at Southall Station at 1.20 this afternoon. Our reporter Simon Viger is at the scene of the crash. Twisted and mangled, the 10.32 from Swansea. It was entering West London en route to Paddington at lunchtime when somehow it found a heavy goods train in its path. 18 people were trapped in the first-class carriages at one stage. At least six people are now known to have died. There were 150 walking wounded, some taken to local hospitals. Our carriage veered off to the left, um, shaking, it went on for about 10 seconds, and then the lights went off. There was quite a bit of panicking in the carriage. There was an awful stench of smoke and diesel, and there were fires developing outside the track as well. The compartment I was in went over at a 45 degree angle. Then there was an eerie silence and then people were amazingly calm in the circumstances in which we found ourselves. The sheer devastation suggests the intercity was travelling near 70 miles an hour, the maximum speed on this stretch of track in western London. There's an emergency.